In recent events, the occupied West Bank has once again become a focal point of global concern as Israeli forces carried out nightlong raids, including drone strikes on the new Ashams refugee camp in Tolkarm. The aftermath of these raids has seen at least four Palestinians detained and 17 others injured, shedding light on the enduring and escalating violence in the region. The deployment of drones in densely populated areas, such as the new Ashams refugee camp, raises serious questions about the appropriateness of force and the potential harm inflicted on innocent civilians. The reported firing of live rounds and flares over the camp, coupled with stationing snipers on local buildings, amplifies the volatility of the situation, placing the lives of civilians at grave risk. The deliberate obstruction of access to two hospitals during these raids compounds the humanitarian crisis. Denying medical treatment to the wounded not only violates fundamental rights to healthcare but also underscores a disregard for the well-being of those caught in the crossfire. The scope of Israeli military operations, extending beyond Tolkarm to towns near Jericho, Hebron, and occupied East Jerusalem, paints a stark picture of a region trapped in an unrelenting cycle of violence. The near-nightly occurrences of such raids create an atmosphere of fear and instability, obstructing any prospects for a peaceful resolution. The arrest of at least 14 Palestinians on Friday, in addition to the staggering number of over 4,800 detained since the outbreak of the Gaza War on October 7, raises serious concerns about Israel's approach to conflict resolution. The controversial practice of administrative detention, where individuals are held without charge, has faced condemnation from human rights groups, alleging its use as a tool to suppress and persecute Palestinians. The rising death toll, with over 300 Palestinians killed since October 7, including 79 children, represents a tragic consequence of the ongoing violence. The recent call by the United Nations to end unlawful killings reflects a mounting international alarm over the situation, with 2023 marked as the deadliest year on record for Palestinians. As the world observes the unfolding events in the occupied West Bank, it becomes imperative for the international community to address the root causes of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. A commitment to finding a peaceful resolution and breaking the cycle of violence is urgently needed. Respecting and protecting the rights and dignity of all individuals in the region, regardless of their nationality, should be a cornerstone of any diplomatic intervention. Only through a concerted effort to address underlying issues can a just and equitable peace be achieved.